Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Lord Nod going and casting a midnight game at the ICGC at Goa between Oxar. And this is actually not R&D. This is the chosen one who's using that account. Uh, but he is playing Zerg, so let's see what's going to be the action and what's going to be the result of this game. We are substantially delayed, uh, really sleepy, and that's just me. And I did want to go ahead and talk about that this is a really long tournament and we have still about a good 15 odd games to go to go ahead and wrap up the night. But I think the games are going really fast uh, and Aksar has decided to pause the game. And they've just tried, tried to go ahead and fix the mice. And as you can see, every game there is a problem. Uh, and that's okay. It's something that uh, we're not using our own computers. We are not using our own uh, mice. And it's often a problem. And this is something interesting for tournaments. Uh, get your own stuff. Get your own rigs. And uh, make sure that you have absolute control over all the faculties that you require to go ahead and play the, play the game the best way. Uh, interestingly, Aksar is not going and doing the standard block off of his ramp and he is actually blocking off um, from the wall and that is something which might come to haunt him against a good player. You have the probe coming, the drone coming down Um, this might actually just look at the top left to go ahead and scout out. Goes and walk, takes a walk around the rocks. Um, has gone gas first. If you look at that's the kind of work that is happening. As far as the APM goes, this is a little like over the top, uh, but this is definitely much more uh, effective but uh, well who's just to say that this effectiveness and speed is anything but two different phases of the same game if you go ahead and look at the units they have pretty much the same kind of a unit composition and productions pretty much going in, in the order of the current requirements a uh, small gastric gas steel actually happening out of here but I don't think Aksar is really bothered. If you see, he's just got one Marine coming out. Ooh, and he realizes this sufficiently. And let's see if he can actually chink it very well. And he has. That is an excellent, excellent timing to go ahead and kill that. So I think he's been looking at this time to go make sure this is done. Also interesting enough, 1 and 5 being the two um, basic compositions of this. But he's got number three as the orbital command. So this is the orbital command for Aksar and this is five for and there's something funny that is happening which we did not get. At all. Well that's okay. Oh I No we didn't. That's okay. Um, and on an expansion, Zergling Speed, another hatchery, which is that expansion going down. Um, this guy is just going to be scouting really well. And a supply depot, the reactor is coming down. And the reactor, I think, will be ready just in time for a swap. It's like, move, move! It's like, okay, there you go. Straight off, there comes two Hellions, and these are normal Hellions, you have to understand, and the expansion comes on the back of double Hellions coming down. There's a Roach Warren coming in, and uh, this is nearly three quarters of its way done. And another guy standing here just wanting to check if everything's okay, and gets sniped by these people. Now there is this sense or purpose that he knows that there is a minor attack coming. Now the question is, he does he put down any kind of a defense or he's going to be just, you know what, this is fine, I'm just going to manage doing that. And five roaches are the answer to that counter. This poor little zergling wanted to go ahead and get a couple of shots off and I think he got one nice bite off 
this Halion. Uh, but let's see what's going to be the next expansion, uh, next uh, move. So two aliens going to try and see if they can go ahead and roast some nice stuff. Uh, I think. And roaches have been exposed. And let's see if the roaches actually take each other on. They take on the Hellions and they will certainly win. And, and that, that's why I think the Hellions are waiting. And this is a nice block off. And Hellions basically say, you know what, well, let's just get map control. And that's more relevant right now. Because here comes another one. The Overlord standing there. Nice watch. This guy's another here. There's two of them standing here. And now is the time. We have the stim pack, the marauders, uh, another factory, another refinery goes down. And on the other hand, Zerg missile attacks for the roaches. Go down. I don't think this is an appropriate response, but let's see. Well, he believes that this will give him sufficient protection and the base. That's fine. Um, and enough gas is now pouring in. I think this is a roach heavy build, so let's see if he actually can get um, some of these roaches actually coming out. Um, he's, warp he's morphing in an overseer here to see if he can get a changeling to go somewhere and figure out. There's a lot of Halions just standing there and saying, Yada, yada, yada. Marauder Slow should be here very soon. And and very heavy on the Marauders. As again. This guy is still standing here. Uh, on the other side, there's an infestation pit which is coming down. So that is something going to be extremely, extremely interesting. Where is it? And if you can go ahead and get that and get a couple of... That's ready. So let's see if he does actually build... expansion here. He's plonking stuff down here. You have four barracks. And here comes the big push. The question is whether this one tank can go cause enough damage to take down this entire thing. He has only three units. Now, very heavy on tech, but no units at all. That's his army. And I know these three are coming down, but they're nowhere close to what you require to go make sure that this happens. There it goes. Queen goes down. Another one goes down. Another one goes down. Flames are shooting. And I don't know what that is. The goes down. Queen goes down. Gone down. Get fire so quickly, and I don't know whether this can go to stay. Um, these are enough of them coming down, and and that is just gets roasted alive, and these guys are just walking it. Yes, for even these guys. And this is going to be just a very tough. 